We really need to be careful of our thoughts. Sometimes we may think that, let's say that something has happened and you are thinking in a certain way, believing that a person has done something wrong to you or they have taken something that you said in the wrong way or you believe that they are saying something to you that is hurtful or you assume that whatever they are doing or saying they are being mean or rude by what they are doing or saying now when we get offended we may say hey if this person wants to be this way let me just like fight back or stay away from that person or whatever and what I am trying to say what you should do is ask questions first before you get offended like hey are you trying to say this are you trying to do that so on and so on because sometimes we think of things in the wrong way. Like a person may say or do something and we may take it a certain way, but in fact, that person has intended something else. Meaning like they are not trying to offend us or anything like that. But I believe all of us we may take things in the wrong way. For instance, myself, I was contacting this one person after a certain incident. So this person never texted me back. So I'm thinking, I know that person didn't get mad at me or whatever else. And you know, some days passed by and I was still contacting this person this person still didn't contact me back. Then I was talking to another person. I'm not sure, but I believe that this person's phone is off. So inside my mind, I thought that this person was ignoring me. But in fact, this person's phone it's off. <laughs> so this is the reason why we need to make sure that everything is okay. I know that even when you do that, some people may lie and say, hey, everything is okay while they have their fingers crossed, you know. <laughs> they are not going to tell you the truth. I understand that, but just do your best just try to figure out before you get offended or take another step make sure that you and the other person or people are on the same page like there are no misunderstandings because sometimes the smallest things get blown up to be so huge like things that are very small. Small things can be so huge if there is a misunderstanding. Does that make any sense? And also, even if they did meant, you know, harm by what they were saying or doing to you, that still should not be something. How can I say that? Even if they meant harm by what they are doing or saying, you still have to treat that person in a nice way, as if that person did nothing wrong to you. Now, there are some people out there where you can't really say anything to that person because that person is ready for a fight. In that case, there is nothing you can really do but pray. But not really the average person, but some people, even if they hate your guts, you are still able to treat that person nicely 
and that person is not going to like punch you or do something mean in return does that make any sense so before you get offended <clears throat> make sure that everything is clear first like hey what do you mean by blah 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 or why did you do this and that and if they have like a weird look on their face like you know <laughs> looking at you crazy and stuff like that then you know that they meant what they did or said but if they have like a shocked look on their face or a confused look on their face or something like that like what are you talking about or what you know so you just want to make sure does that make any sense because hey this goes for myself as well because I took things in the wrong way too I thought that this person was acting funny because of something that was said or whatever but this person's phone was off go figure <laughs> so we have to know too that demons are out there and demons are going to try to cause chaos as much as possible so one of the many ways that demons can do this is through misunderstandings I'm telling you misunderstandings because even if there is no problem demons will make a problem through misunderstandings so don't fall for it don't fall for it sometimes people misunderstand me sometimes I misunderstand people it is a common thing but we don't want to make any further mistakes with misunderstandings and so really pray about it pray about all issues if you are confused about it now I am not saying that I pray eight hours a day and stuff like that no but if there is something that you don't understand pray about it and more than likely God is going to clear up that issue or give you more understanding of that issue that is going on does that make any sense so prayer is necessary so that is pretty much it really <laughs> okay guys God bless